Today, we are going to introduce the SkyDroid S1 Pro set. The box for S1 Pro set has two layers. On the upper box layer, it has the H12 Pro remote controller, S1 Pro flight controller, and some cables. The S1 Pro is equipped with the H12 Pro remote controller. The rocker controls the throttle and the flight attitude of the aircraft. The buttons and the thumb wheel switch has no functions for the time being, and it will be developed in the near future. The toggle three position switches is used for switching flight mode on the left, while the toggle three position on the right has no function at this moment. From the upper interface, there are same car slot, Type C charging port, four pin LAN port and PPM output or serial cable port, which has a built-in R12 Pro receiver, enabling stable data and video image transmission over long distance, as well as the transmission of 1080p high-definition video streams. The next one is S1 Pro module, which is equipped with a vehicle-grade sensor BMI-088 which can provide low noise and low drift characteristics in temperature fluctuation environment and has good robustness and stability. Those two antenna ports are used for connecting the antennas. From the other side, there are Type-C USB connector, POW connector, and one more connector which is under development. Okay, let's check out the other side. From left to right, there are PWM12 output channel, SBUS interface, and AUT interface. The last side of S1 Pro, it has the LAN port, CAM port, and GPS port. Those connectors are integrated into the S1 Pro. Under the S1 Pro, there are some cables and the 3M stickers inside. Those cables are S1 4G feeder cable. Power cable. An audio cable. The second layer has optional equipment. Customer can choose different version of S1 Pro. The basic set is containing the 3-in-1 camera with regular meter level GPS. SkyDroid also offers the C10 camera and the directional centimeter level GPS as options. This set are equipped with a 3-in-1 FPV camera with a network port, which is set to 1080p resolution by default. Both sides are equipped with 
high intensity and the high beam headlights, which can provide clear vision during nighttime operation. Also, don't forget the network port cable and the camera. This is the sheet metal which is used for readjusting the switch if the switch cannot return to the center. There's a charger with cable for the H12 Pro controller in the box. The cable can also be used for connecting the black controller to your computer. The bottom side are the S1 flat long antennas, which needed to be installed on S1 Pro flight controller. Next is the regular GPS, which can be replaced with the directional GPS set. This is all in the S1 Pro box. Thank you for watching the video. We are going to release the testing video for the S1 Pro soon. Please subscribe us on YouTube to watch more about the S1 Pro future testing. Thank you.